Worldwide, 35% of the global food supply is highly reliant on animals for pollination. Unfortunately, severe declines in the supply of managed honeybees and the abundance of wild pollinators have been detected. As a member of the Pollination Investigators Citizen Science Team, you can contribute to pollinator research and conservation. Instead of observing bees, our program measures their activity, or pollination service. In this study, we measure this by weighing pepper fruit and counting seeds. Based on the amount of pollination provided, we can infer how well a landscape supports needed pollinators. Interested participants will be sent a toolkit that includes sweet pepper seeds and other materials needed for your experiment. In addition, you will need to provide one three-ring tomato cage, a stake or fence post, and a food scale. To initiate your experiment, start your seeds indoors using a seedling tray or small containers. One week prior to transplanting, Harden off the seedlings over seven days by moving them outdoors for increasing increments of time. After hardening off your seedlings, it is time to plant and establish your treatments. You will select four of your seedlings for this study and plant them approximately three feet apart. Plant A is the exclusion treatment. This treatment measures fruit production in the absence of insect pollination. Insert a three-ring tomato cage over your seedling at planting and place the mesh bag over the cage. Bury all edges of the bag in the soil to prevent insects from gaining access. Secure the top of the bag with a rubber band. Insert your garden stake or fence post next to the cage to prevent it from falling over in windy conditions. Plant B is the open pollinated treatment. This plant will illustrate fruit production in the presence of insect pollinators. After planting, this treatment is set until harvest time. Plant C is the hand-pollinated treatment. This plant will demonstrate maximum yield potential given the growing conditions present in your garden. When open flowers appear on plant C, collect pollen from male stigmas in flowers on plant D using a cotton swab and transfer it to the female stamen of plant C. Check plant C weekly and pollinate any open flowers. By comparing fruit weight and seed set among these three treatments, we can determine how effective the pollinator community is in your landscape. Peppers should be harvested 70 days after planting. Harvest all fruit present from plant A, B, and C and place in labeled paper bags. Count the number of fruit present on each plant and record on your data sheet. Place all fruit back in the bag and randomly select three. Weigh each of these and record on your data sheet. Then, remove all seeds and place in provided envelopes. Send us your completed data sheet and seeds in the prepaid mailer. Watch our website for project results. Thank you so much for contributing to Pollination Investigators.